name is Cal Alston. I am a professor of uh, education at Syracuse University, and I'm also the uh, chair of the National Advisory Board for Imagining America, which is a consortium of about 70 higher ed institutions that are engaged in supporting and furthering the aims of public and engaged scholarship. And that's my entry into ACLS. I was asked by Joy to come to a uh, meeting of a group of fellows that they had uh, funded who were doing engaged work as part of their research agenda. I loved it, it was great fun, and I uh, have subsequently come back for a number of different activities um, that partially are related to, again, public scholarship, connecting to other humanities and humanistic studies. I'm a philosopher of education. So uh, and now uh, through ACLS, I got to meet the executive director of the American Philosophical Association, and I now serve on the Public Philosophy Committee. I have had a number of different encounters, and some of them uh, been working with graduates, advanced graduate students, postdocs, um, who were trying to find a way to bridge to work post-graduation, and then also with institutions that were trying to make change. And probably that's the place where I felt like I had a lot to offer since I was one of the people who was trying to craft change in my own institution um, and through Imagining America. One thing I've really appreciated about ACLS over the last few years has been that they're really trying to identify problems. And as a philosopher, we always like to say, our job is to identify the problem, ask the right questions. And I felt like ACLS has um, been flexible enough to respond to the, what might be considered traditional questions of the uh, humanistic social sciences and humanities, but also really grappling with the ways in which, for example, uh, undergraduate willingness to uh, major in humanities has fluctuated, um, uh, in, not in necessarily the, the uh, good direction, and what that means for everyone sort of across the food chain and about the support that institutions are willing to give. And I really appreciate their platform as a, as a place where all the different disciplines that are represented in that uh, in that group can get together and talk about solutions. My participation in the programs to which I've been invited in ACLS has really enhanced my own thinking, my own work, my ability to contribute to the institutions and organizations uh, that I help lead. And so I feel like I should give back because I want these programs to continue for support for uh, graduate students, support for junior faculty, and support for the disciplines um, to take up the issue of doing collaborative and cross-cutting work.